Welcome to clickmyproject.com Let's discuss about the product. Our product is Voting Based Directional Interpolation Method and its application to Still Color Image Demosaicing. In this paper, we present a novel color demonstrating algorithm to Voting Based Edge Directional and Direction Method and a Directional Weighted Interpolation Method. By introducing the voting strategy, the interpolation direction of the center missing color component can be determined accurately. Along the determined interpolation direction, the center missing color component is interpolated using the gradient weighted interpolation method by exploring the intra channel gradient correction and the neighboring pixels. As compared with the latest demo second algorithms, the experiments show that the proposed algorithm provides superior performance in terms of both objective and subjective image quality. For past reasons, when the currently available digital still color cameras captures a color image, for each pixel only one part of color information of the three color channels is captured based on a single charge coupled device sensor. Typically, only one 8-bit number that measures the amount of red, green or blue is captured in the pixel. The sensor is covered with a color filter array that is CFA which causes each pixel in the camera to capture only one color channel. This is because only one color element is available in each pixel and the two missing colors must be estimated from the adjacent pixels. This process is called interpolation or CFA demosaicing. The color reproduction quality depends on the color filter array templates and the demosaicing algorithms that are employed. Based on the Bayer pattern, various demosaicing algorithms have been proposed in the past few decades. These methods were proposed to obtain a full color image by utilizing the color difference between the green and the red or blue planes in spatial domain or frequency domain. The advantages of these methods is that the it is the efficiency in a smooth region. However, these methods suffer from more or less artifacts on the reconstructed irregular edge and texture details if the interpolation direction is not estimated correctly. So, the flow diagram gives an overview of our product. Initially, we have taken a color image which is to be demosaicing. So, as we already discussed, the CFA is concludes the overall process of demosaicing. That means the CFA is not a separate process, it concludes the overall some sub-divisional functions in the process. So initially the taken image is taken for Bayer encode and the Bayer encoded image is applied to cross filter and then the cross filter array is applied. After that QEFT that is quaternion Fourier transform is applied to the process. So by the QEFT after image that image is finally obtained which is called a Let's see the demonstration of our product. As we already discussed, our product is based on MATLAB programming language. That means our product is based on MATLAB programming. We have program in mat main.m. So you can see in the work directory, this is a MATLAB main window. So we have used MATLAB 13 years as a lesson for the development of this product. So these yellow color files are called mat file, that is matrix file which contains the values. So regarding to selected image, the details will be visible here. So main.m, you can see the similar name with different formats that is .m and .figure. So this is the programming file and this is the graphic user interface. While I am running the program file main.m, it will recall that main.figure as a frame or booth for button process. So here I am selecting the main.m and I am going to run the process. So the main frame will open. So this is the main frame of our process. Here these are called the access and these are called the push buttons. Every push button has its corresponding code in the back end of this product. That means we have some MATLAB programming. So initially for example I'm, if I am pressing the select image process means it will redirect the database folder and we have to select the image that will be visible. 
so I have select processing select image inside the data I am going to select any image as input for example I am selecting the image so the selected image will be visible here so for crop so for what I am doing crop is in is here because for every demosaicing process it will not be visible for applying full images so if I if you are selecting a, a particular region by cropping means that will so what are the inter pixel values for visible so see I have selected a little bit and I am cropping that particular region so you can see these yeah, changes in the image you, you can zoom and see the changes so I am going to process this image I am applying Bayer encode this is the Bayer encode process and decode to have to do so during this encode decode process and noises of removing and then applying filtering so during this component filters there are you can see the daughter pixels this process is called the pro process to be removed by the cross filters so I am applying cross filters so during this cross filter that uh, we can identify the components that means if we know every channels that means RGB channels there are three channels red green and blue in every channels we can see what are the components and what are the components to be filtered and what are the components to be replaced so those components are identified during this uh, cross filter and then for uh, demo checking we are applying LPS filter so during this filter we are obtaining final filtered image so and then we are applying QFT spectrum that means in that we are processing quaternion Fourier transform so this overall process is called the color filter array so in color filter array as we already discussed most of the process demo checking process is based on encode bare, bare encode and our CFA also based on this bare input here I am doing QFT spectrum so you can see the values the PSNR values and everything will be here so the final spectrum of our image so that is shown here so the performance of the proposed system will be visible here while pressing the process so this is the comparison chart with the uh, PSNR and MSC value that is mean square error. Thank you.